Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are hunting for strawberry and banana prime in Asda. So, as of yesterday, apparently, I could show you the picture on the screen, but apparently they've stocked up in Asda literally yesterday, prime strawberry and banana special edition. So maybe they have limited edition bottles in Asda as well. I'm not entirely sure. Today's Sunday, meant to come out yesterday on the Saturday, but yeah, I thought, let me go and have a look. The special edition stock is expected to last until week 30. Okay, I don't know what that means. Arrive in store from Saturday the 13th of April. So basically, it should be out today. I've come to the biggest Asda near me. I don't know if you guys can see it. It's a giant Asda. It's a really, really big one. We're going to go inside and try and find it. And because it says special edition, it might even be limited edition bottles. I'm not entirely sure, but let's go inside and find it. Also, this Asda, I'm low-key scared to go inside because... Let me tell you guys a quick story time. I'll tell you as I walk in, actually. One time I came here, they have like... You know you have a photo booth, right? That you go and take like passport pictures in and like other stuff like that. Someone had done a poop in one of the photo booths in this in this Asda that I'm walking into right now. So low-key, it traumatized me and I'm a little bit scared to walk past it. It was this one right here but it looks clean to be fair. But yeah, this Asda is just in general, not the cleanest Asda. I'm just very like, yeah, scared of dirt and germs. But let's head on upstairs. I don't know if it'll be on a stand or in the actual drink prime section, but we'll head there now. I don't see anything at the front of the shop to be fair. Okay, literally at the front, you've got pillows, laundry detergent. Here's the drinks they have, literally normal drinks. Okay, I'm gonna head straight down to the prime section then. YouTube viewers. I don't think they have any here, to be honest. I literally do not see any down here at all. Unless it's in its own separate aisle. That's really strange. Last time this Asda had so many. The store literally has none in stock anywhere. So I'm gonna head on down to like a petrol station Asda instead and have a look at the drinks there. Hopefully they'll have some there. My sister also wants me to get her earplug. This station has Greg's inside. So I can get a little Greg's meal. I want a coffee. Oh, I really want a coffee. Okay, I'm gonna do that. Well, I can't exit this side of Asda. I don't know how to get out. I'm low key stuck. I think I need to go through the cashier bit. Let me get out of Asda and then we'll head on down to petrol station and Greg. Anyway, the next petrol station I'm going to show you guys there's so much stuff inside. I think they have a Cinnabon, a Greg's, they have like some Tango ice glass machine. They also have a Subway and a pizza place. It's also an Asda too. So obviously you're going to get Asda check for Prime and then also, oh I should have asked someone inside. I always forget like oh I can just ask someone if they've got a delivery but I didn't see Prime anywhere, not even normal Prime. So I was like maybe this Asda just don't do it. I might do a little Q&A session with you quickly as I eat lunch so you guys can get to know me a bit better. I did go on my Snapchat a few days ago and I asked you guys to send me a load of questions so I'm going to go through some of those and answer them while I eat. So yeah let's head on down to the next Asda, let's get lunch, do a little Q&A session then move on to another Asda as well. Here's my local Asda petrol station and then it's got a Greg's and a Subway inside so let's go look for Prime and then let's get some lunch. I still don't know what I want to get. This used to be a spa and then literally like a few weeks, no, that's a lie, maybe six months ago it changed into an Asda Express, but it's basically the exact same thing. But yeah, let's go and have a look inside, which is over here. And normally they have Prime by the till as well, um, but I don't actually see literally anything here. Even at the till, there's nothing there. We'll check in a minute. Let me actually get food now. Ooh, choco melt. That looks very appetizing. I had this Lowe's when we went to Amsterdam a few months ago, but I haven't really had it in the UK. Okay, I don't know why I'm looking at this stuff. I need to get actual food. So the options are Subway over here. Apparently got some new stuff there as well. There's a pizza place up here or Greg's down there, but I think I might get a Subway today. Guys, don't judge me, but for sauces, I literally get ketchup, mayonnaise, and barbecue sauce together, but it actually tastes so good. Turkey breast ham, and then cheese and toasted as well, please. Don't think they have Prime here anywhere. I'm gonna have a look at the front of the shop as well, but in the actual drink section, there's nothing there, which is a shame which is fine. There's still a few more Asdas we can go to. There's one more Asda, which is like a 20 minute drive. So after I've eaten, I'm gonna go there. I fingers crossed they have it, but let me know down below if you guys managed to find it anywhere because I just can't find it. So dumb, I've left my phone in the car. I'm actually so dumb. How have I done that? I literally never leave my phone anywhere. I was about to pay and I was like, wait, I don't have my car, I don't have my phone, but I'm hoping it's in the car and I'm hoping like, I haven't lost it or anything, but let's go have a look. I hope I haven't dropped it or lost it. Is it here? It's right there. I'm so stupid. I don't know how. I've done that. I literally never leave my phone anywhere. Guys, as I was getting my food, I came back to the car to get my phone and these guys behind, they were like, oh my God, hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, but they were so nice to just have a conversation with them for like 10 minutes. They were just asking me about what I do. Then like, how much money do you make? And I was like, I'm not saying that. What am I doing now? I'm eating and I'm doing a little Q&A session. So let me see what I can put my little camera down. There's nowhere really for me to put it, unless I can put it down here actually. 
and pan it up. Now that is the weirdest angle ever. Let's not do that angle. So let me get my questions up that you guys asked me on my Snapchat. Follow my Snapchat if you're not already doing it. And yeah, let's get started. The first question was, do you, did you go to university? Um, yes, I did. I'm actually 24 years old. So I went to university and I graduated in 2021, which is a few years ago now. And I did a master's degree in neuroscience. And neuroscience is basically learning about the brain. So I learned about different brain disorders and mental disorders and what drugs you can use to treat those and also how those mental disorders or brain disorders actually happen in the first place. So I learned that and I studied that for four years. What's your favorite game? I have a few different favorite games of all time. I think Watch Dogs on the PlayStation was an amazing game. The Sims 3 on PC, beautiful. Animal Crossing and then Super Mario 64. But I feel like you guys might be too young to have played some of those games. What made you want to stream? I love your videos, thank you so much. Um, I've been doing TikTok for four years now and I've been doing YouTube for coming up to a year. I grew my following and it was really fun, but I didn't get to interact with you guys. And I thought, what's the best way to interact with my followers and my viewers? Because I enjoy speaking to you guys, etc., etc. And I feel like it's nice building a community. So back to the question. The reason why I decided to start stream is number one, I like games, I like gaming. Number two, I wanted to talk to you guys a bit more and actually get to chat to you guys. And that's exactly what I've been able to do now. I play games with you guys. We do Fortnite custom lobbies. I've been able to make friends with you guys and I've built a nice community, which has been really fun. The next question, a lot of these are to do with gaming. What games do you play and how do I join? I play Fortnite custom lobbies and to join you just hop on Twitch in the evenings. I stream every day around 6 p.m. Guys, the best subway order in the world. Let me open it up and I'll actually show you what's inside, but it's got to get a bit messy, I think. It's a bit messy. I'm just going to eat this and I'll see you guys at the next Asda. Next video, I'm thinking I might do like maybe another Q&A actually. I think I might do a Q&A while I bake something, maybe like the new viral cookie croissants. If you haven't seen it, here's a picture. I think I might do a Q&A in the next video while it's baking. So if you guys have any questions at all, please comment them down below. I might reply to your comment or I will answer it in the next video. But yeah, I'm now at another Asda. Let's go on inside and hopefully Hopefully they have prime. I also need to get my sister a couple bits and bowls. She's basically revising for her exams right now. And my parents are on holiday, so both of us are dog sitting. She's been really like busy with the dog as well and she hasn't been able to revise. So I was like, let me go get you some energy drinks, mate, because she's very tired. So I will get her prime energy. Actually, if they have prime energy, I'll get her that. Otherwise, I think it may be a monster. I'm just waiting and hoping that soon we'll see like a strawberry and banana prime stand in one of the shops because yeah it was meant to come out by now okay first of all i'm going to check right here and see if they have a stand but do they one time they had glowberry prime right in the middle and literally had like thousands and thousands of bottles but i don't see any down here the main thing they've got is pringles some new flavors of pringles what are these barbecue ribs smoking sour cream don't sound appetizing i guess we're going to head on down into the prime section there's no stand either Here's the primes. Yeah, I kind of thought they wouldn't have it here because there's no stand. There's a prime original tropical at the top, so I could get my sister that, but I can't even reach that. They've got, what they got here? Meta Moon for two pound, which I actually haven't seen in shops in a long time. Tropical and then blue raspberry, lemon and lime, and literally no strawberry and watermelon anywhere. Why are monsters so expensive? One pound 70, which one's this one? Ultra. She needs a lot of energy, so I'll get her this one. I asked the lady off camera and she said they couldn't find it. They don't have it on stock list. So I have no idea when it's coming to Asda. Maybe it'll come to Asda in a few days time and I'll go back prime hunting. But let me know down below if you guys managed to find it. I'm going to go home, give the monster to my sister. And yeah, thank you so much for watching, guys. And yeah, make sure you like, comment and subscribe. Let's get this video to 1000 likes. Love you guys so much. And I will see you all in the next one. Bye.